Hello students, welcome to Sam class. So today we're going to talk about the most, most, most important thing and that is the top colleges that we can get through CET and Comet K and if in case they have a separate exam like PESAT. So let us first understand what is a good college, bad college and how do we classify, how do we see. So while searching through the Google, it was very difficult because everywhere the list is different whether you search in google top 10 college top 15 top 20 college of ct and irf ranking it is way 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 haywire okay so it becomes very difficult to understand the rating system based on what they have rated now let me tell you an honest opinion from my side i sat from the past four to five days i was sitting for this what do you say which one to take, which one to be in the top 10, top 5. Top 5 was pretty recent. If you see, almost the top 5 in everywhere, wherever you search in whatever the sites, whatever the YouTube videos, whatever, any place, top 5 were same. But the game starts after 6th or 7th. After 6th and 7th, it is very difficult because the data given by the college in here and there, we don't have sufficient data to judge whether this college is good okay whether the placements and everything is happening and based on what criteria we're telling that this college is superior than the other college so here was a very difficult thing so what i thought is at least i made a tier system tier one tier two tier three wherever colleges were with similar placement kind of criteria like almost similar package similar placement similar campus tour i made it one tier okay so like that i made three tiers and after that all rest colleges were kept in, kept in the fourth one now understand in tiering making it to the tier system i also used one more thing at what rank these colleges were closing and what rank you were getting approximate not exact data because see this data what i have taken is almost from the second round of counseling of kct 2021 so based on that and Comet K, I have made as proper, as honest it can be. And I have tried my best. If any were difficulty of finding or any mistakes, I'm really sorry for that. I tried my best for this. Now in tier one, what we see, RV, PES, BMS, MSRIT, any four you choose, all is awesome. Maybe you talk about campus, maybe you talk about placements, maybe you talk about branches and even a lot of students, they have this doubt, sir, in these colleges, if I'm taking EC branch, civil branch, mechanical, is placements happening? These top four colleges of Karnataka, which you are getting from CT and Comet K, yes, placements is there for each and every college and for each and every branch also. So, and you already know RV is among the top ranking what do you say in terms of placements with a very highest and very good package around 46 to 50 somewhere 54 also so and a lot of data is there about rv PES also similar bm is similar and the is similar research is good strong alumni network is there almost all good companies are coming okay so you have a damn good thing if you're taking any stream in these four colleges it's good you don't have to worry about it now let's talk about and these colleges if you want to take CS branch or CS with specialization like a lot of colleges these colleges they are providing not just computer science but CS with AI, ML, deep learning or design or CS with uh, what do you say data science, cyber security. So all this together if you are learning then what you can do you can take those streams also very good and in one of the video the link will be there uh, we have already in the description we have already given what is the difference between whether i am taking a cs one or i am taking a cs with specialization okay so what is the difference and how i can make up to that so that at the end of the four year i don't have to worry whether i have taken a normal cs or i have taken a cs with specialization now all these colleges under 2k it will be done cs uh, rv and all it doesn't go under 2k also it's like within 700 600 it is gone but still just all these four total applied here and there with specialization everything cs 
related fields gets over by under 2k okay now about the management quota and all you can go and check okay these colleges if you are having money and like good amount and sufficient amount of money and if you really want to study then you can go for management and management is nothing like illegal under the table or something like that it's very simple like see a college needs a lot of fun to run it so what they do few seats they take it from ct few from comet k and the rest they keep it to for the running budget of the college as a management part okay so there they charge bit or a bit bit more hefty extra okay so these are the tier one colleges which is rv pes bms msrit now regarding sir which one is more better which one is the, what is, is rv better than pes and a lot of videos are there uh, and uh, is pes better than bmsc almost all again and again i'm saying all these four are of almost similar kader almost similar okay so you don't have to worry you can just take any of them now important factor which i'll tell you at the end of the video at the end of the video i'll be telling you about the important factors do watch till the end very very important factors along with the campusing and everything at the end i'll be telling you why most of the students they find it very 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 difficult to secure a very good rank or a very good cgpa or a very good company or sometimes they lag behind what is the basic reason and that is a very simple reason and they should have taken care of that okay it's very very important so we'll talk about that in the last section of the video coming to tier 2 and we have uvc gss nie bit bms it and management dsc smbit sit tumkur so all these colleges and if you want to take cs in this any one of them under 7k chances are there good to go now if you talk about the campus placement branches research companies here i cannot say all branches you get the campus in. few like uh, civil and all here and there plus minus not exactly every companies and a lot of good companies come in the what do you say non cs related branches so here cs ec is like very awesome field but others a bit slight doubtful okay not that but slight now these colleges are better or uh, how they are see tier 1 tier 2 not much of differences there okay but slight is there that's why they are put up in tier 1 and these are tier 2 so the environment the students what you are getting and everything here a bit lower but here also if you are doing working hard we'll talk about the factor what is the most important factor to give you a success after your four years so we'll talk about that in the end section of the video so do wait and watch it okay that's the most important part and if you want to skip if you already know the tiers one and if you already know that which college you have selected you can go to the last section of the video where you can directly watch what is the most important thing for your four years of part and what is the most important thing that you need to see and check while choosing the college next if we talk about from 7k to 20k rank you get nmit rnsit rviit is a new branch of rv cmrit bnmit kle ramayya university of applied science gss academy of technical education ait riva acharya pesmandia sdm north horizon new horizon uh, nitte mallad geetam so all this they are almost if you are in the rank zone of 7k to 2k and you want cse so you can prefer this college almost similar now don't start a fight sir uh, rvit is a bit more better than this so or almost similar you can take any one of them without doing much pressure on your brain and you can work out apart from the cs and ec branch i won't suggest you uh, what is if a civil and other branches in these colleges placements is low if you want to study just for the knowledge is yes, very good but placement part you have to work hard on the off campus then again for the all in colleges after that whatever were important 20 plus rank kls gokte shahadri sgb cambridge global academy jain oxford svit vidya vardhaka uh, what do you say gosia bapuji venkateshwara vaimana nagarjuna vivekananda ms college engineering college basaveshwara alliance university atme east west college revana gopalan what do you say brindavan government engineering college saptagiri bahubali all this college and dot 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 you 
the line what is it the list goes on so whatever extra whatever left already everything is kept in this okay and whatever is left out is you can understand it is all in uh, this fourth section fourth tier where all in college after 20k rank you can go for it now what is the most important criteria for selecting a college see student wherever whichever college you go the most important thing that will lead you to your success is to watch it till the end of the video will tell you see you already know that is your self study so whichever college you go if you are not doing your study by yourself then you will be bored now in order to do self study what you need the most important factor will be time okay so here this one will be most important see if you are not denoting devoting the time how will you improve whatever let's say you are in a top college but if you are not giving time to study those subjects of the college like csu you have taken and you are not giving time to study that at the end of the four year will the college give you a campusing will you be able to get the campusing even if a lot of companies are coming you don't know a single thing about it so what along with the college what you need to see is let's say i'm selecting let's say college a and i'm residing here if this college is let's say 2 hours to 3 hours far from me and every day i'm taking a bus and going 2 hours coming 2 hours so 4 hours every day i'm wasting then it will become very difficult and very 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 hectic very difficult and very hectic to manage everything because you won't have the time to self study now mostly people of karnataka and especially in bangalore they finding it very 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 difficult because they're staying in one part of the city and the colleges are far so and they don't give priority to the what do you say distance and a lot of times i have interacted with the students second year third year and they saying so we want to work hard but every day 2 to 3 hours is going in the morning bus and while coming also so 6 to 4 to 6 hours is going sir so and after that we are too much of tired we don't have so much of energy so that we can put up and study and then we are lagging in the first year our cgp is going down and we are not able to what is a concentrate so students i'll say this give a very 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 important factor because this will give you a lot of time save a lot of time so that you can even if your college is a bit less you can work hard you if you have the time you can use utilize it a lot of resource i'll be providing you free resources where you can use those resources that is available okay and you can compete with any of the top college but you need to have time to do so so according to me and the most important thing that you need along with the colleges you should choose a college which is near to you otherwise you should you'll be ending up you'll end up wasting a lot of time okay and that is not a good thing you won't be able to do a proper internship you won't be able to do work on real time projects and everything so everything matters with the time part so you need to make this one your first priority manage the time so that then only with the available resources you will be able to study for the college now coming to what about campus placement research see nowadays in the digital era we and if you are taking for cs you have a lot of amples of what do you say a lot of ample options for research with the other professors outside along what do you say within your college also outside also so even if your college is not able to provide that good research you can if you are hard working if you want to do a research you can do with an outside professor you can uh, what do you say put up the research you can write it down you can mail it to them a lot of options are there but if you don't have the time you won't be able to understand or learn the subject only then there is no point in being in a good college also so if option permits try to stay as near as to the college enjoy the life i will know what is it the college life along with that have the knowledge now a lot of times this question has already been posed what is important the knowledge or the cgpa see if you just having the cgpa just with a mug up that's bullshit no need but if you are understanding the thing you are gaining the knowledge you are applying it to the real world and then you are having a good cgpa that is very very important because your cgpa plays a very 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 vital role when the company select you the minimum criteria for sitting to the company okay to apply for a on campus they'll have a minimum percentage 
So if you are having a good percentage, that helps you what you say in setting to applying to all the companies. So try to make that as a major target, not by bugging it up, but by understanding the subject to the core. Now, internships and real-time experiences will help you uh, in your channel if you haven't subscribed till now. So do subscribe, it will be helping you for your engineering career for the four years. Whatever kind of help you will be needing it in order to have a grand success okay at the end of the four year so that once you are done with the college you'll be like yes whatever i really needed to learn from the engineering college i have done and i'm now ready for the market okay so internships whatever you are related to related internships will try and help you provide will try to give you the resources which which areas you can go which uh, websites you can go and search for internships and real-time experiences that that helps you to check whether whatever the learnings you have done from the book whether you are able to apply to a real life problem or not now college definitely plays a very very vital role and giving you a very awesome environment okay that boosts you motivates you but again along with that you need to have the time fit factor as the number one criteria from my side so that at the end of the first year you should not say that half of the time or 60 percent of my time just got wasted in the transportation or coming and going from the college so that should not be happening so try to give this factor a very 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 much important and a priority so that you don't get in this part because we have interacted with a lot of students and we found out that this one is also a, one of the major issues that the students are facing uh, facing that they don't have ample amount of time to study and to do internships or to what is it make the base rocks on it so from my side that's all so if you like the content and everything do like share and subscribe share with all your friends so whatever to the best of my knowledge add with the round two cutoff we segregated the college under 2k rank so 2k to 7k 7k to 20k and after 20k plus whichever way we were uh, it seemed fit but along with that stressing on the major important factors what plays a major role is time because at the end of the day in order to study you need to have time so try to work hard on that and make yourself give yourself the best time and the maximum amount of time so that you can think about what you are interested and whether you are liking or not and how can you improve on the uh, what do you say areas where you're not good so that's all for this video and uh, work hard best of luck and if you have initial suggestions do write it down in the comment i read each and every comments second thing is if you want us to make a video on any other difficulty or problem that you're facing do write it to us and apart from that Jen, see you in the next video